Hey guys and welcome back to another video. So today I have another 642 things to draw and it's been a while since we've actually done one of these. <laughs> so yes. So today I'm going to be doing these four pages, well these four prompts, which is a cabin, mushrooms, shrubbery and Bob Marley. So let's just zoom in here on the first one and we're having a mascot today which is a little whale eye crocheted these are available on my shop if you'd like one um, link is in the description so yes he will be our mascot and he's just gonna sit right there so for today I'm gonna be using my Stadler Mars Technico pencil and a random eraser with a smiley face on it okay so so I'm only gonna do like a easy one I'm not gonna do something that's too tricky I'm gonna start with the square yes. I used to do a bit of architecture in school and I would seriously get told off right now because I'm not using a ruler but I'm okay with that these are just little sketchy sessions Oh no. I snapped it because I pressed too hard. <laughs> no. <gasps> That's what I get for being heavy handed. <laughs> I am working on that. It's just for some reason I find it easier to draw heavy handed. And then a little dog. Yep. If any of you have not seen these videos before, they're basically just sketchy videos where we just practice drawing without worrying about it. It's basically just to warm up and at least try and draw something for today. And so if you do have your sketchbooks, you can draw along. It doesn't have to be in a 642 things to draw book. So as you can tell, they don't have to be perfect drawings. You can just have fun and at least say you drew something today or like it's good for art block or lacking inspiration you can just take one of these prompts and draw <laughs> and if you peeps are enjoying this video and you do want to see more 642 things to draw videos please hit that like button supposedly supposed to help out so yeah and it's free too <laughs> i think that is the cabin we're gonna just do a bit of pathway some things like this probably a Another giant tree here. And there we go, there is a sketch of a cabin. <laughs> now we'll move on to shrooms. Now mushrooms are definitely something that I love drawing. They're just fun. <laughs> I don't know why. I, well, it might be because they're quite strange looking. Emily likes to draw strange looking things. But this is like my go-to mushroom that I like to draw. I don't know what species of mushroom it is because there's so many. There's probably like billions of different mushrooms out there. And they're probably very poisonous as well. <laughs> In fact, I bet all mushrooms are. Apart from the ones we eat, obviously. Yeah, that won't go right down. Well, if we were having a stew, turns out you've got some death crap mushrooms <laughs> in your stew, you'd be a little bit poorly or in trouble. And just like that, we have a finished mushroom. There we go. So let's move on to the next one, which is shrubbery. So I imagine shrubbery as like bushes. <laughs> and I've just Pinterested it and it has come up with bushes and like flowers and stuff. So I might just draw flowers or leaves. Because that, apparently that's, that's what it is. So we'll just sketch some, some shrubbery. And I might add a bush <laughs> as well. A little cherry bush. If that is an actual thing. I'm sure it is. Because where would you get cherries from? <laughs> cherry trees. Cherry trees. See, I'm looking on Pinterest and it sort of has like a lot of different things. Like you have these flowers and it's like, have you ever seen pineapples and their skin? It's kind of like that. And then it's got some flowers like this. And then coming out of those are these little balls. <laughs> little balls. Okay. <laughs> like this. Don't know what plant that is. And it doesn't say, I don't think. So there you go. You can only just see that. <laughs> see? It's just easy to sketch things and not worry about it. I might put a tree in here because I'm sure that counts as shrubbery. 
Yeah, I'm gonna say that's that for that. <laughs> now let's move on to Bob Marley. Now I need a picture of this guy because I can't remember. Oh, I can, but not off the top of my head. Oh, my lanta. Oh my god, this might take a little bit to do. Alright, I think I've figured out how I'm gonna do this. So, this pencil ready. I'm just gonna draw a circle like this. His head's tilted this way. And then that's the bottom of his chin, like that. And it goes around like that. Now, I'm gonna switch to pen. And I'm using my Unipin fine liner pen. And I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go for it. Just gonna go. Now this was my um, brother's suggestion to pick Bob Marley from this book. I was a little bit nervous about it. That's why I decided to do the whole page. Just in case this one goes to pot. <laughs> but I'm sure we'll, we'll, um, we'll make it look at least something like him. You might not be able to tell at the moment, but I'm pretty sure. It'll start coming together, hopefully. <laughs> I'm using a reference from Pinterest, if anyone would like to know. I am not drawing this from memory, because I can't remember what he looks like exactly. I know he does reggae music and stuff like that, but that is it. I do not know much else I should do, considering I'm a muso. And that goes like this, going like that. <laughs> it looks so funny on camera. Bear with guys, bear with. It is gonna look like it. I am certain. Once I've erased the pencil lines, should look at least something like the guy himself. Might I need to get a bigger pen in a second. Some lines and hopefully the pen doesn't smudge that I've just put down. Yeah, it's smudged. Oh my. Oh my. Okay, so he has like hair that goes up like this, and there's an ear somewhere around here, and then the neck, beard line. I hopefully when I've coloured all this in it will look something like him, so, because it's a different style to what I usually draw, and then there's just lots of... Right, let me find my um, pen, one second. Okay, so now I'm going to be using the Kuritake brush pen to fill all this in and then hopefully once we step back and look at it it will look like Bob Marley hopefully I decided to do this reference image because I have seen it everywhere and if it doesn't look like Bob Marley that's okay you peeps know, know and know that that's what I wanted to achieve with this drawing it's quite hard to draw with this brush pen. Only use it a couple of times. Mainly use it for doing large areas like this because detail. I don't have a steady enough hand to do that. I have shaky hands. Do 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 do. Da -da 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 -da. I do know that this will go through onto the other page, but that's okay. I am aware of that with this book. If you peeps didn't know, it's not really good for markers. It goes straight through onto the other side. So it's, it's a lot better just to use pencil in this book. Again, it's not for finished work, I don't think. For me, it's just for practicing. Oh, I need to get the thing because I've gone over that now. got to get my white jelly roll. I'm going to go show Joe in a sec whether he likes it or not. Oh, he thinks I did a good job. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully he'll approve. I'm going to see if I can try and get it on camera, by the way, his reaction. Don't know whether I can or not. I will try just for you guys. Sneakily. Where's the rubber? I need to try and get this off here. Alright. Let's go, let's go. Joe. Do you want to see how it is? Huh? Yeah, do it. Yeah. How did I do? Does it look like Bob Marley? Does it beat yeah? <laughs> Okay. Yeah, it's good. Thanks. Thanks, I appreciate it. Okay, so there you go. <laughs> it does a bit. Um, yeah, if you did enjoy this video, please leave a like and comment below what you think. Share with your friends and subscribe for more. And a big thanks to our mascot <laughs> in this video. 
Um, I think I'll be doing this for every video I do now. I'm just going to put a little crochet plush out that I've done. <laughs> and yeah, if you do want one of these for yourself, there's a link in the description box. There isn't many left. Um, but yeah. Okay. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you next time with another video. Okay. Bye.